Melbourne Arena has been transformed into a true world-class venue for gymnastics, with some of the best athletes from across the globe taking part in the individual apparatus competition. Georgia Rose Brown will be part of the Australian Women's Charge and is looking forward to competing in front of the home crowd. This will be my third Melbourne World Cup now. It's always an awesome experience like to be out there in front of a home crowd, um, get your friends and family out here to watch you. you know, it's, it's always a great experience. Despite all the training, Australian women's head coach Mihai Brestian says competitions such as this weekend's Melbourne World Cup takes things to a whole other level. I think it's better competition at higher level than we have in the past. You know, I'm here in the second in the World Cup this time. And uh, I believe they will raise themselves to the, to the stage of this level. The Melbourne World Cup counts towards qualifying for the 2020 Tokyo Olympics. And Sweden's Jonna Atletag is hoping for a solid start to her campaign. Uh, all of these meets are going to be important and of course it's uh, Olympic qualification. But I'm trying to just focus on uh, doing my routines and getting experience and uh, not to think too much about the Olympic qualification because I know I'm always going to do my best in competition anyway, so I'm trying not to put too much pressure. In the men's competition, Chris Remkes is fully aware that the strong internationals bring out the best in him and will be of benefit to his 2019 goals. I think competition is a whole different thing, uh, totally different experience, but preparations into that makes it what, what it is. Competition starts on Thursday evening with finals on Saturday night and Sunday afternoon at Melbourne Arena.